Here are the horses for the second race. For pacing three-year-old fillies, the Hayes Memorial. One cozy little sealster owned by Mike Nicely and J.D. Finn of Newton with J.D. Finn driving. Two family fling owned by Brian Pinsky and Volumite Stable of Chicago. Pinsky is up. Three fresh start owned by Cotton, Julie, and Francine Nash of Lexington. Tony Morgan gets the call. Four panned out owned by Don Stevens and Norman Levine of Chicago and Indiana. David McGee is up. And number five, Power Scooter, leased by Joe and Joanne Thompson of Phoenixville, Pennsylvania. Andy Miller behind Power Scooter. The 7 5 outing. She showed a last quarter in 24 and 4 at Hoosier Park. Very rare. Sub 25 second last quarter. Maybe the only one ever paced. Gates rolling, and here they come. They're off and pacing, and there goes Panned Out, roaring from the outside for McGee, getting out second between horses. Fresh start on the rail, cozy little Sealster. Now she moves up second. Panned Out on the outside, challenges for the lead. Dropped in quickly third is Fresh Start. Along the rail, Family Fling got away four. Power Scooter can see the field as they drive now toward the quarter mile mark, and on the outside, up to get command, is Panned Out. The Jake Lobel filly and McGee scoot away by three lengths, rolling as they drive toward the quarter. Panned Out past that station, onto the backstretch, 27 2 front pass and she is driving down the back stretch, headed toward the half mile mark and panned out. Leaves cozy little Sealster by five lengths as they drive toward the half mile mark. Racing on the inside third as they race that way is fresh start. No change along the rail fourth family fling and out the back power scooter as they drive to the half and now the pace slowed by panned out as the lead has dwindled to only two lengths. Cozy little Sealster is their second as they reach the half mile mark. At the half and 54-3 they're racing into the upper turn being led by panned out Cozy little Sealster honor and racing third is fresh start fourth still family fling at the back power scooter as they're headed through the third quarter now midway through the upper turn approaching three quarters racing with the lead panned out off the rail here comes fresh start and Morgan the Abercrombie filly to the outside is now second on the inside panned out has the lead challenging fresh start racing third locked in cozy little Sealster for a family fling five and trailing but moving as power scooter they're past three quarters they reach the top of the lane as they're at that mark and 123-1 and as they're in the lane driving toward the wire panned out has survived the challenge and leads it for McGee through the lane to the wire panned out over fresh start panned out by two and a half lengths fresh start is second battle behind them for third power scooters third at the wire it belongs to panned out her margin now five lengths under the wire second is fresh start finishing third power scooter four was family fling five will be cozy lil sealster and in that race panned out duplicates her lifetime mark 151 one fifth panned out is trained by tex motes of fairfield who also trained the dam of this filly Kareen Wood about to make presentation to the entourage from the Moat Stable. This filly now with earnings past 200,000. That win puts her beyond 200,000 for the year. Over 320,000 life. While she is not Illinois bred, she's by Jake Lobel. She is from the Illinois program, so to speak, because her mother is the masquerade mare panic attack that set a number of stakes marks.